Nestor Cortez is on the mound. Ten starts, four and one, 1 1.70. All the numbers are just outstanding. In fact, everything is really good. The Cortez deals. Strike three. Fastball outside corner. And it's like Ward wasn't expecting Cortez it. Cortez deals. Grounded sharply to second. Torres down to one knee. And he gets Otani for the second out. 3-2. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with the cutter. Angels go down in order. One, two, three. Two strikeouts for Cortez. Angels nothing and the Yankees coming back. Shohei Otani ready to go to work and make his ninth starting assignment of the year for the Angels coming off that game against the Toronto Blue Jays in Anaheim on Thursday. And Carpenter really building an unbelievable at bat. It is so true, Michael. They're Ten pitches now. And but there goes the deep right. It is high. It is far. It is there. It's a home run. Oh, did he hit that one? But it went right down the line and just inside the pole for the home run. Carpenter really nailed that one. He hammers it into the right field seats, and the Yankees take a one nothing lead. No two down, and that'll bring up Glaber Torres. High drive, right field. Ward back. Track, wall, see ya. A home run for Torres, and it is two nothing Yankees. And like a good Glaber, Torres is there. So Cortez getting into trouble here in the second inning. Now he'll face Andrew Velasquez. The 0 2. Ground it and grabbed by Rizzo. Gets to his feet and beats Velasquez to the bag. Rizzo just saved a couple of runs to end the inning. And Gallo works a walk. And here's Aaron Hicks. The 1 0. Lined into center field off the bat of Hicks. It's going to be in there for base hit. Gallo will stop at second. Hicks picks up a single. And the Yankees have runners on first and second and nobody out. Here's Jose Trevino hitting 263. High fly ball. Lagares. Runners tag up. Lagares makes the catch. Both runners tag. The throw to third. Not in time. Gallo gets in and Hicks moves to second. Good base running by the Yankees. And Gonzalez a switch hitter batting left. Infield pop for Renjifo and two gone. The one two. Ground ball for Renjifo to get Shohei out of the jam. It'll be a one two to judge leading off the bottom of the third. That one is drilled to left field. There it goes. See ya! A bullet home run off the bat of Judge. His 19th of the year. It's 3-0 Yanks. Oh, that was a judgy and blast. All rise. Here comes the Judge. Now man in second, man in first. The Yankees with the opportunity to basically open this one. And that is going to do it for Otani. Now he'll stay in the game as the DH. Here is Quijada. Well, Gonzalez turns around about righty. That's ripped to left field. That's going to be in there, and it's going to go to the wall. Hicks scores easily. Trevino will stop at third. Hits an RBI double for Gonzalez. It's 4 0 Yankees. Well, here is Otani, who now is a DH. Two balls and two strikes to Otani. Into center field for a base hit. So Shohei having some success in a two strike count. So now Mike Trout started with strike one. Mike. Nice. Got him. It's a bad day for Otani. He gets picked off. Probably didn't have any clue or have good Nestor move his to third base. <laughs> One, two. Strike three is called. Seventh strikeout for Cortez. He has a five inning shutout and he struck out seven. Well, here is LeMahieu. Two to lead it off. Two, two. Drill deep to left field. That ball is gone. A home run. Fourth home run for the Yankees. They lead 5 nothing. Oh, David John makes long gone. The Yankees have the bases loaded with the top of the order coming up. And they will send up Miguel Andujar to pinch hit. High fly ball. Left center. Trout is there. He'll make the catch. Tagging is Hicks. He'll score easily. Moving to third is Trevino. It's a sack fly. Pinch hit sack fly for Andujar. And it's 6 nothing Yanks. Here is Judge with two men out. One, two once again. Came in and got him. Not before two more runs can score for the Yankees. Now a 6 0 New York lead. Oh boy, the Yankees got lucky with Cortez. In their greatest fantasy, they couldn't have dreamed that Cortez would be in effect 
as good as any pitcher in baseball this year. He is deadly when he lowers that arm angle, especially to a left-handed hitter. None of this stuff is going to light up a radar gun, but there's something about him. He can get people out. And Clark Schmidt will take over. His numbers are good. He's pitched well. This will be his eighth game. And the Angels put their leadoff hitter aboard for just the second time all day. So here's Otani. Started the game for the Angels. Didn't have it. Here's the payoff. Strike three. Fastball. Strike three. Otani didn't think so. He doesn't argue. And Duffy walks. So first and second with two men out. And that brings up Renjifo. Next delivery on Renjifo. That's a little liner. It's out of the reach of the shortstop. The Angels are going to get a run on that one. It is coming in and scoring from second will be Taylor Ward. So Renjifo gets his first hit. And now the bases are loaded. So Peralta will come on to face Walsh. Yankees have a five run lead, six to one. One, two. Fly ball, center field. Judge cutting in front of him is Hicks to make the play. And Judge has a big smile on his face because you know what? The catch was made. Here is Marwin Gonzalez to lead off. Gonzalez, two for three on the day. Slaps that on the ground at second base. Nicely played by Ren Hifo. Now one away. And here is Anduar. And there's a swing and a miss at an elevated fastball, and down goes Anduhar. Well, here is Judge. Judge off the end of the bat. Flips a fly ball out to right that Ward makes the catch on. Last chance for the Angels in game one, down by five. And there two way. And he walks Taylor Ward. And that'll bring up Otani. Peralta checks the runner at second. And deal. Swung on a miss, and that'll do it. As the Yankees win 6-1, to one, they've taken the first two games of this three-game set.